you like a clown, bitch, you waiting on the purse. I can really put you down, bitch, you waiting on the purse. She said, why ain't fuck her twice? I say, I'm waiting on my purse. Hold on, hold on, hold on, wait, hold on, wait. So, today, I am going to be filming a mukbang slash high school freshman advice video because I know some of y'all might be scared, you know? But currently I'm in the car. I'm about to go pick up my friend Mavis. She's also one of my roommates. And then we're gonna go to Chick-fil-A, get some food, and we'll get straight into it. Yeah. Okay. Yes. One, two, one, two, three, yeah! Mavis is here. So this is Mavis. She's my friend and also my roommate. We've been together 28 days. You're 28 more days. So now that we have her, we're gonna go to Chick Fil A, and then we gonna give y'all some advice because I know I know some of y'all need it. I know freshman year of high school. Maybe you're a little. Scared. Maybe you're a little nervous. It's There's okay. nothing to be scared about. Can you imagine? I don't even. Freshman year seems forever ago. 14 years old. Oh God, I was. So, I was baby. so ugly freshman oh, year. Super. I learned a few things. Baby, the year. hair, the outfits, the makeup, the face. <laughs> no, ma'am. It was just really unacceptable. But it's okay. Everybody go hit their glow up. Oh, really I hit mine really late. Mine was senior. I was, I was senior a late year. bloomer. I, I didn't get bloomer. there till yeah, senior year. <laughs> senior year. I was I was a late bloomer, but it's fine. Okay, so we'll come back when we get there. Okay. Okay, so we just got our food. I just got a fry. Guys, I'm this. really disappointed. I got a um, mango passion tea lemonade. I guess it was new, but it's not that good. Are you putting that? What are you putting that on? N number one, number one, do not mess up your freshman year. You have no reason to mess up your freshman year because you're taking your easiest classes. Don't be um, like me, I messed up my freshman year. Like freshman year, you're not even doing but so much. You know, you're not really going out that much, all that. So you need to be, you need to be in the books. Period. Because freshman year, I did bad. Okay, so the thing is, if you end up doing bad freshman year, don't just keep going down that path. I did okay my freshman year and then see, sophomore year I got it together like I had all a sophomore year and all junior year yes, my went literally back up. cannot stress this enough do not mess up your freshman don't year don't settle for grades that you know you can do better on like I settled for the B's knowing I, I could have easily had an A because don't do that freshman year think about it what is your excuse to be doing bad and if you start off bad that means your GPA for it's all the four years, it's already starting off low. So if you finish freshman year with a 2.5, you have Ooh. to work a t up from a 2.5. And that's very, that's, hard. I that's hard to do. Make friends and make memories. Like she said, pick your friends wisely because high school really is like, high school is what you make it for Honestly, me yeah. i had a great high school i love experience. high school a lot of people like i talk to they're like i hate high school it's so boring and i'm like high school's only boring if you make it boring yeah like, we was litty yeah we had we made like fun things out of like we literally made memories like yeah dreams, but like. it's all about and don't get into unnecessary drama because it's drama <laughs> i stay out of drama i've never, never been in drama. drama i don't do drama my friends weren't in drama like seriously when i say pick your friends wisely you need to because some of these little kids yeah some of these little kids they are thrive fake. they thrive off of drama sorry it's guys all open okay huh it's all open. i don't know okay. next you already put your mouth on it sweetie i'm gonna be doing that <laughs> you have scissors in the car it's the wrong next side. thing be you because Honestly, nobody cares about what you're doing as much as you think that they do. No one gives a fuck. Like, I used to be like, oh my gosh, somebody might be looking at this, like what I'm wearing, my hair, yada, yada, yada. Literally, if you just are being yourself, people want to be friends with that version of you because. And honestly, everyone goes through an ugly stage. Like, you just got to get through it. I'm not even. Pay attention in class. Yeah, I slept a lot. Because I used to sleep in class, but stop playing because I made I made good grades. Yeah, I made good grades. But you need to pay attention in class because in some of your harder math classes, if you're over there joking around, sleeping, 
you gonna wake up and be like what are we doing like what's going what's going on here I don't know and also don't um, don't overload your schedule like with a bunch of AP classes I learned this the hard way I know this isn't about senior year don't take AP classes your senior don't. year I promise you no one no colleges care I loaded up my senior year with three APs Colleges don't, do don't even care that much about APs, honestly. And it's just they unnecessary don't. stress. I'm not saying don't take any, yeah. but don't be like, oh, every class has to be an AP because for what? What's the point? Yeah, I recommend be... taking at least one or two years, like throughout the all four years, just because then you're ready for college. I took one. Because it's like still, like, it helps you a lot. And if you have a good teacher, it's fine, but like, don't overload yourself. And take, if you're an option, if you have to take a language, don't take Spanish, take Latin. If your school offers language, Latin no, and Spanish. take I Latin. Learned, I learned the hard way and I took Spanish, so I was Easiest like, Easiest ah, A Spanish you will is hard. ever yeah. get Latin. I could sleep the whole class and still make an A on the test. Like, light work, light work. Spanish was hard. This Chick-fil-A sauce tastes different. So good. I'm what not impressed. I'm not impressed, Chick-fil-A. I'm not. Next, um, okay, this isn't even that big of a deal, but seriously, don't be in the way in the hallway because y'all that be just standing there, don't do it, trying to conversate, and you're in the middle of the hall. Like, you in people's way. Some people try to get from the other end of campus to the other side, like, and y'all just be standing there chilling, like, it's a party. Oh, you, you need to go to class. Please don't be that freshman that's like loud in the hallways. Don't be that freshman. Don't be that freshman, because I promise you. Everyone all the already classmen, hates the freshmen, so yeah. don't give them a reason to hate you more. Dad, don't be that freshman, because I promise you, all the upper classmen are gonna look at you and be like, "Shut up." Well, okay, really, okay. <laughs> Everyone's like seniors hate freshmen, and yeah, we do, but like we really be okay, um, valid, though. because y'all be doing too much, like way, way too much. Um, just. Be chill. Just know your you place. don't have to be. Just know your place. Know your place. If you're a freshman, stay in a freshman's place. Period. Um. And they're busy. They're probably just going really. Fast. I don't like these. They don't taste right. Some is off. Okay. Let me try one. Maybe it's the sauce. I don't know. Maybe it's just you. Tell me it doesn't taste different. That's not how Chick Fil A sauce tastes. I think it's the fries. I think it's just dirty. Next, don't be scared to ask questions because chances are somebody else has the same question as you. Oh, and no make, question is a dumb question. If you need answered, ask it. Make good impressions with your teachers. Like you for can, sure. Because you're, when you come back for your senior year, like, and you need senior recommendations or something, like you can ask your freshman teacher. And it's also like nice yeah. to like go back your sophomore year and like if you need help with something like a lot of teachers if you're on good terms with them you, you can like go back and like ask for help and stuff because they usually know what's going on so yeah don't be that kid that's like obnoxious to your teachers and like yeah mess like if like, you mess with your teachers and they start messing with you like they will help you out they yeah. really will i was cool with all my teachers yeah and all my teachers loved me yeah well you know vibes like, what was my favorite year i wonder my junior year I love junior year. Junior year was so really, fun. I feel like junior year was really fun, but that junior year I was so stressed out about classes. I did, I no, I had better grades my junior year than my senior year. Yeah, no. Mm. Also, try and take, um, try and take more credits, like your underclassmen years. So like freshman through junior year. So if you can pick up an extra science, like I took a, anatomy you know like pick up extra classes that way your senior year you can have more electives rather than having core classes because who wants to go to that yeah nah. and it's also senior year you're not gonna ever want to go to class so it'll be yeah. easier if you don't have core classes so try and build up those classes before you get to senior year um next don't stress too much it's like Stressing about school, about high school, for what? For what? Um, there's so many ways that you can help yourself. Like, our school had tutoring sessions and stuff. You can ask your friends for help. Join clubs. Join clubs. Maybe it's just so off topic Sorry, right I just now. <laughs> Join you can ask your friends for help. You can um, ask teachers for help. They'll stay after school with you. Especially See if you have test correction opportunities oh yeah, you will, and take advantage of it. Freshman year, a lot of teachers understand that. Like a lot of freshman teachers understand, like you're still transitioning, so they're they're gonna like help you out with like 
tutoring and stuff and a lot of teachers do, yeah. do give test credits but like after that they won't so don't don't bank on that like the rest of your years but freshman year definitely like they'll go easy on you just because they yeah, know don't, you're still transitioning don't count on it or if you have like you can do like test corrections or like quiz corrections that'll boost your grade up too okay like she said join clubs get involved um it looks good honestly I don't think I even put clubs on a college application. Like, I don't think I was asked that for Kennesaw. You did for Kennesaw? For Georgia State. What were you saying about your clubs? Join, Join clubs. Join clubs. Why? Because it's fun. And, like, they are fun. And also, like, um, if you want chords your senior year, it's a lot easier. And, like, um, a lot of times, this isn't, like, if a lot of clubs have meetings, like, during school, so sometimes it helps you, like, get off to a class or something. Yeah, sometimes you get to miss class like first period or something yeah and she it's like just that. honestly like um it'll help you get to know your grade more because a lot of people do do clubs and like teachers and stuff get involved go get to involved. definitely get involved go to like the sporting events go oh my to gosh, your football please games do that. football games are elite in There's high school stuff. the only way i think the main way like i came out of my show was like going to football games and like that's why senior year we were literally yelling at everybody and like senior everyone year, knew, we like, were view crew you we know were view crew yeah but that's also because we went to all the sporting events and stuff like be involved in your school a lot of people are like oh that's so lame like why do you like no nah, don't be people? the don't be the annoying annoying freshmen that just stand there in the student section that yeah, that. that is literally so you're annoying. Gonna get if you're gonna at. do that, yeah, the seniors are gonna yell at you. We yelled at everybody for doing that. For sure, you're gonna get yelled at. If you're just gonna stand there, go sit with your mom or stay home because, baby, you're interrupting the student section. Yeah, and like, if you have more, a lot of school spirit as a freshman, definitely when you get to senior year, more people are gonna know who you are and they're probably yeah. on view. If you like go to our school, you're gonna get like view crew or something or like. Or like, if more people know you, you have a chance of being like homecoming queen or something, being on homecoming court, you know, all that stuff. Just get involved with your. I'm so mad. I was gonna school. run for a prom. I was gonna run for prom. Yeah, I was gonna run for prom court. court. I wanted to be on court so bad. To. I think I was gonna be on. Don't really, don't really worry about what other people are doing. You know, yeah. Like you need to do you. I mean, yes, have friends, make friends, go along with stuff, but like. Don't, don't change yourself for other yeah, people. Yeah, don't be your be you. Don't change yourself. Um do what you need to do for you. Because some people in high school they're like, oh my god, it doesn't even matter. Baby, it matters. It definitely matters. Do that. Um just have fun. Yeah, just have fun. Make memories. Enjoy, enjoy your high school year. Enjoy it because they it will goes go fast. So fast. Like, as a freshman, I was like, damn, I still got three more years of this. And now that I come out, I'm yes, like, I got to freshman like, I'm year, to I was like, I remember my mom and dad, they were like, it's going to go by so fast, Jay. I was like, you're chatting. It's yeah, not. But it then does. I looked up, and it was already senior year. It then, you know, school got, yes, is it? <laughs> Y'all, I'm literally going to college. I don't even... I don't, That's when so I had, weird yeah, to me. I All right, guys. So, change of plans. <laughs> Okay, maybe, but sorry. Okay, change of plans. So, <laughs> so my friend just Kendall just called and she was like, I'm, "I want to get my nose pierced today." And then Steph was like, "She's gonna get hers." And I've been wanting my nose pierced. I already so, have mine though. Yeah, she already has hers. So I guess we're about to get her nose pierced. My mama is gonna beat my butt. Oh God.